Pay attention. You fools. What are you idiots up to now? You're on my turf now. Watch your step, Fox. Pigma? Don't know anything about Pigma. But there is one thing. I'm owed an apology. And I will have it. That's enough for now, Fox. Pigma's no longer part of Star Wolf. And if he'd shown his filthy hide here, my men would have driven him out. You talk too much. Panther, Leon, let's go. Remember this, Fox. Star Wolf will take you down one day. Don't get uppity, you amateurs. Can't believe I'd get beat. What's the problem? You done already? What? That's easy to say after all you've done. Enough small talk. Let's settle this, Fox. It's been a long time, Fox. Come on, I'll be your dance partner. You've gotten soft, pup. You ain't your father after all. No! Don't mess with me, Fox. Now you've done it. Go down, Fox! That's the end of it. You impudent... Where are you? <laughs> so you've finally given up your R-wing, eh, old hare? You got questions? You're gonna have to outfly me first. No hiding, Fox. Show your face. You're a pitiful sight, pup. You're the one who dropped in unannounced. And if anyone's gonna tan your hide, it's gonna be me. Wipe that stupid look off your mug. We're not done yet. That's the truth of it. Accept it, Fox. I thought I told you. I didn't come here to save you. <laughs> so how long you plan on taking up space on my wing? Fox, let me give you one piece of advice. Don't hesitate. When the time comes, just act. You want some, boy? Didn't you know that was my prey? Hey now, what's all this about? You all right? You look ragged. You're on my wolfen, Fox. Don't disappoint me. It's the enemy, Fox. They look like sturdy little monsters, don't they? These things again. They aren't worth the time. Looks like they got a thing for us. The battle's on, Fox. They're all over us. The rest is up to you, Fox. You're not slipping, are you, Fox? <laughs> You've gotten a bit better, eh, Fox? You got some skills, pal. I've taken heavy fire, but I'm just getting started. Ah, can't seem to pull it together. No, oh, I'm not used to being the one taking damage. Ah, oh, looks like I'm not as sharp as I used to be. What are you aiming at? What are you doing to my darling Wolfen? You stupid dog, get a hold of yourself! Point that thing at me and you better be ready to die, pup. Curses! Oh, so this is it. Curses! Someone's locked on me! Nicely done, Fox. Quit your croaking, toady. Ah, Fox! Do you even see the enemy? Ah, Fox! Don't let him attack! Ah, I'm eating blaster fire. Don't let me down. I can't shake him. Ah, do something, Fox! Don't hesitate, Fox. You gotta do it. Don't give him time to charge and attack. We can't give him time to charge. We'll be destroyed. He's charging up his energy again. Ugh, Fox! Don't let him attack! The more we're hit, the worse off we are, Fox. Fox, missiles! Shoot him down! He's launched more missiles. Blast him, Fox! Fox, missiles! Pick him off! Ah, in case you haven't noticed, the enemy's attacking. What are you doing? Blast those missiles! Curses! Got one on my tail. I gotta shake him. I got some scum chasing me around. Attack! Hey, hey, I'm the one who's taking damage here. That's the way to do it. Give it your all. Okay. Looks like the aperoids are in bad shape. Ah, uh, that won't do, little fella. You sound like a lost pup. Don't start sounding like a coward now, Fox. Leave this missile to us. Missile down! Ha! <laughs> that was too easy. Fox, leave the enemies around the gate to us. You guys take care of that giant menace. What are you waiting for? Shoot that thing down. I guess you survived, huh? Let's do this. You think we're just gonna sit here and watch you work? Help, help. Shut your trap, you little crybaby. These scum are proving to be quite a handful. Keep your advice to yourself and your eyes front, pup. We'll distract him. You guys take out the queen. Leon, Panther, let's go. Come on, you stinking bugs. Catch us if you can. I'll get it done. Ha! Is that all you got? I'll take care of everything. Hmm. Victory's mine! That was a waste of my time.
Oh. Ah! Oh, big shot. That's mine. Ah! 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 Oh. Victory's mine! You will be a god among men. Norton, do you really think you can get rid of the evidence by shredding documents and wiping hard drives? Genevieve Aristide dug her own grave and she's going to have to make herself comfortable in it. Now don't be a fucking lapdog and jump in after her. She was a very disturbed child. Terrible, debilitating nightmares. Hallucinations. Hysteria. She never had a chance in a normal life. It was Distler who realized she was telepathic. He speculated that she was extremely sensitive to the negative emotions of people around her. We removed her from that chamber only twice. She was 15 when the first prototype was born. She was supposed to be comatose, but she started screaming when we induced labor and didn't stop until the liquid filled her lungs. There are plausible scientific explanations for everything that followed, but I think it was really just a question of hatred. It is the way of men to make monsters. And it is the nature of monsters to destroy their makers. You will be a god among men. Take her back to the vault. Well, here comes Sheriff Preston now. Sheriff Thorne and Maxville County Sheriff Preston are now working together to find the fugitive brother. Sheriff Preston. Howdy, Alden. Sheriff Preston? How's my car? Still a pack of your sunflower seeds in the glove box. Working hard? You will. Well, Alden, I came here because uh, there was some trouble in York County last night. Clint's been shot. What? At the dirt track. He hit the wall at full speed. Is he alive? It's not looking good, Alden. Alden! Come back with my car! Not to mention Preston swooping in if he's needed. I mean, sweet tea, Maddie, to go. A PI? Aren't you going to miss playing with your pets? Most men enjoy their retirement. Touche. Oh. No, no, no. On the house, remember? Wow, yeah. Hey, thanks a lot. What can I do for you, Alden? In it around? Well, what do these things ever mean? I wouldn't know. York has them locked up tight. Yeah, for a York County detective. Maxwell County has problems of its own. What? That's because I spend less time eating barbecue with my buddies and more time out on the streets and in the woods solving crimes. Clint. And now you're a civilian. But all right, I'd be stupid to ignore your instincts. You're a good sheriff. A great sheriff. I'll look into the graffiti. Just promise me with this PI business, you don't go turning over stones you can't put back. I do. Best mentor I ever had. Oh. Stay safe, Alden. I didn't know that you mentored Preston. He's got a pretty loose definition of the word. What did he want you to do? So who shot Clint at the racetrack? <sighs> Extraordinary. Oh, good grief. The paperwork on this one. Oh, uh, sir? Yes, yeah, Scooter. Did you get it unloaded? <sighs> you did good. Clint would have been proud. I'll get him. Look, I know you're hurting, but we got to look at the bigger picture. If what that scumbag says is true, we're dealing with an entire organization here. And when Sloan becomes sheriff, things will get even more complicated. What are you talking about? I heard from the mayor this morning. He said if Clint passes, Sloan will permanently slide into his place. Slo I want him behind bars yesterday. So do I. But you gave me a bullet with Scooter's fingers on it. In a stash of cash, I gotta shove into an evidence drawer until the end of time because we don't have any pictures of anybody's hands in the cookie jar. I don't believe this. Just give me time to collect my case, all right? Let's make sure we get the head of the snake, not just Sloan. <laughs> Let me do my job. Clint will get his justice. <laughs> Things have gotten too messy, Alvin. That's the difference between me and Sloan. Sloan didn't like getting his hands dirty. He trusted too much in the middleman. You know, I never care if you much, Preston. Sloan was all about the money. 
I wanted the power. Power? Control criminals. Own them. Make them do what cops can't. That? Kids spray paints under a bridge? You don't bring them to me? You make them paint the back of Maddie's. Maxville County is a safer place because of me. And your county was on its way. Until now. <laughs> Come on! Clint's dead. I have the Prattlers in pocket to testify against Sloan. You killed Sloan out of revenge. I killed you. In the name of the law. Yeah, you were a good sheriff, Alden. You just didn't have what it takes to go all the way. All right, steamboat, let's go. Here comes the big clear. Ready? Hut one! Hut two! Hut two! Steamboat, wake up. Now you're out of bounds. Oh. You gonna be much longer? Oh, next touchdown wins. Sorry, it's family dinner night. I've missed for the last three weeks. If I miss again tonight, my dad will disown me for sure. Okay. Okay, Cheever. You win. We'll split. But just once, I'd like to meet you and your goons out on a football field without your badges. Yeah. <laughs> and the two of you blew it when you quit football after high school. Do we have to go into that again? Some law. Come on, Dad, really. It's always nice to see old friends again. Well, we got ourselves a football game against the cops, if you can believe that. Yeah, I know it's a lot to ask, but there haven't been any feds asking for you in over a year. I think it's okay. Stop them pigs. No. Look, all I get around here is criticism anyway, so I'll just do us all a giant favor and split. Guess again, pal. Now, where was that we said we're eating lunch? Nick Sipes, the hitman. His attorney's talking to the DA. I don't like anyone putting hands on me. I was just saying hello to Stacy. And this guy here, Dex. He's more than the hello roper. You were pushing it. Spy sapping my teleporter. We got it. This one's ours now. Sentry down. Ah! <laughs> Woo! Woo! Job well done. That wasn't even close. That heavy's a spy. I wish y'all could see how bad I'm kicking your tail. Dominated eye patch. That catch your eyes, son. You done incurred my wrath, son. How much are all these coffins costing you? You dumb as a box of rocks. Y'all come back now. More where that came from. Next time, tend to your own knitting, sawbones. Sell your tonics elsewhere, miracle man. You must be a doctor. That is the God's honest truth. You look a mite tongue-tied, son. You ain't too fast for me and my machines now, are you? What in Sam Hill were you thinking, string bean? Dominated. Don't test my metal, son. Dominated, you damn Yankee. Dominated, you snake. That's what my daddy taught me to do to backstabbers. Scoundrel. If y'all had more gadgets for killing, at least you ain't worthless anymore. We gotta hold this point. Hold this point. Incoming. <laughs> <laughs> Giddy up, boys! Woo! Big Robot's got the bomb, boys! When y'all meet your maker, tell him to build you some guts next time! Yeah! We did it, boys! Robot ain't been built, can't get shot! We need a dispenser right here! Somebody wanna wrestle up a teleporter right here? Darn! Oh, shucks! Damn it! Damn it, fellas! Damn it! Damn it! Damn it! Damn it! Oh, hell! Heck no! Ah! 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 Will you look at that? Another satisfied customer. Plant yourself on the point, mister. You ladies should oughta brought some men folk with you. I'm gonna tear you down, Junior. I'm done playing games with you, boy. Get along there, little doggies. I'm gonna lay you out. Why don't y'all get along before one of you gets hurt? Son, I'm gonna blow that dumb look right off your stupid face. Much obliged. This thing ain't on autopilot, son. Yeah, heck yes. All righty then. Ah, oh, hell. Hell of a shot, mister. Nice shot. Nice shooting, Tex. Gotta move that gear up. Nope. Nah. Heck no. Oh. Oh. Ah. Ew. Oh. Oh. Damn this game to blazes. Oh. Mmm, that's good. Ah. Life of Riley. Mmm. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Ah. Yeah!
I think the only thing Nancy knows about a car is that the rearview mirror is too small to do your hair by. <laughs> David, would you open your eyes for once? Malcolm. No, you want to get her in trouble? No, dummy, I'm trying to save her. Really? Yeah. Well, I guess you'll have a lot of time to think about all those other things while you're walking home. Oh, well, sure it does. At least now we're speaking to each other. And it gives me a chance to say I'm sorry. And if I recall correctly, you'd always forgive me by the time you were finished. Hmm. I'll let you know. <laughs> huh. What did Dad sort of say? Why, you want me to wash it? Oh, what am I going to get him? Hey, just don't get him a magazine subscription. I got them a year of National Geographic. This hour could have been yours. Instead, it will be mine. I'll see you over you in the end. The drill bit, the rope I had left over, I scrambled on down. Listen, was he bleeding? Not much, no. He's in bad shape. He hurt his head. He hurt his head? Yeah. Uh, he's taking hydroporothocide and methyl dopa. He's hypertensive? Mild hypertension. This guy's been nothing but trouble. Oh? My assistant had her hands full last week just getting his x-rays. What's wrong with it?